Hello everyone, what I'm going to do in this video is the guided practice on using a protractor. We're going to do 2A, 2B, 2C, and 2D. So if you have a protractor, that's great. You can do these and then check the video for the answers. If you don't have a protractor, uh, just follow along with me right now. Okay, so our first one is measure of AFB. So of course, this part I'm doing for you, I'm going to put the center of our protractor on our vertex F that has to go right on there. And then that little line at right here, that crosshair has to go on that straight line. So that's gonna go right there. And now we're starting with angle AFB. Okay, record the measure that you see for AFB. Pause the video. Okay, next one is CFA. So it's CFA. Again, I'll put that down there. Okay. Record your measure. Our next angle is AFD. So we're using this side again, AFD. Again, record, this will help. So record AFD and then CFD. So I gotta move it this time. So notice I'm, I've gotta use the side of the angle. Okay, and then record that. Write down your, pause the video and write down the measure there. All right, now I'll measure them for you. AFB is going to be an acute angle, so I know it's not 157 here. It's going to be 21, 22, I'm going to say 22 degrees approximately. If you had one degree more or one degree less, that'd be okay. CFA. Oh, I can use that. Okay, I'm getting a measure really close to 90 degrees. AFD. So AFD, it's more than 90, so I know it's not 65, so it must be about 115 degrees. And then CFD. It's acute, so I know it's less than 90 or less than 90 because it's small. Notice that's a small angle, so it must be either 24 or 25 degrees. I'll just put 24. And if you're within a degree, I'm going to accept your answer here.